So what's up ladies and gentlemen, Josh Fisher here, and today I thought I'd show you my Nerf slash BB gun collection. So there's my collection, let's get started. These babies, these were used in my zombies for real thing. These are actually not BB or Nerf, these are like laser tag guns. I forget where I got these from, but these were used in zombies for real, which was my, uh, my, oh man that got pushed in. Which was my hundredth video, so these are these babies. I was like, this little pea shooter doesn't work anymore because look at, oh, now it does. Oh, no, it doesn't. See, look at the assembly, I think, broke. But what was supposed to happen is every time you, oh, it does do it. See, look at closely. Yeah, we got this baby. Watch. Now, this does shoot like, like that. Only reason I'm not showing you shoot is like what I said. I have no clue where I put my bullets because like a super mini mini Uzi like that. This is my first BB gun right here. As you can see, the clip comes out like this. That's what it does when it shoots. Uh, it does have uh, like a strobe light to it. It does have an uh, laser sight, but it doesn't work anymore. Oh wait, yeah, it does. I don't know if you're supposed to be doing that to a camera. I don't know if it's going to frig it up or anything. Mini, my mini Uzi. Was that loud? Watch, right? So yeah, this, this one's busted. As you can see, the front got broken off. One of these sights broke off right there. So this seen better days. Here's my sub. He's on like MPL with grip. Once again, that gets pulled all the way out and then... And then, if you can tell me why it has those red tape marks on it, you win a cookie. Now, I'm joking, but the reason why it has that red t stuff on it is because this was from when I did Zombies in Real Life, my 100th uh, video on YouTube. The MP5K from, uh, like, Mall for Two, except it's blue. That goes back, and then that fires like this little... That was funny in the video. I was, like, doing like this, pretending to reload. Oh, my goodness gracious. And then we have one of my favorite ones, which is that it doesn't bolt back anymore. See, it's supposed to do that. But I think that's a super easy fix because it's just, I see the rubber band inside. So you just do like that. And it's like impossible to do. There it is. I'm like feeling lucky. Punk. Cap guns. I have two cap guns. These babies, as you can see, these have been used a lot. You can tell because when you look inside there... Both of them. I shot at least a thousand caps on each. I love how they're like eight rounds like the Bloodhound in Black Ops 3 Zombies. See, so yeah, I'd just be like... <laughs> this is the funniest thing. This I actually can shoot at the camera. It's a disc shooter. Right, I'm going to pick those up later. <laughs> She's out. So that was a disc shooter, everybody. My rifle. This, I love doing like the model spin on it, like this. I broke the other one. If you saw that model video, I broke the other one. It was like the cheap plastic. You'll also notice I've used a pencil to pull this thing back to cock it. So I can be like, and then also that comes off. Now this one's another cool one. This is a, I'm not going to shoot my camera with this. Would, or do I? No, I don't want it because I don't want to mess anything up. But the coolest thing about this is when you uh, put this here and you click eject, that shell comes out. So that's pretty cool. And then you just, that's how you really you load them back in like that. And then that's it. This is you gun used to, watch, wait, listen. This used to make a noise. It used to be like, do, do, do. And then... That's funny. If you walked in it, you'd never want to walk down the street like this because then people are going to be like, what are you doing? I'll be like, we're loading. Now, this is like my pride and joy almost. This is my MP9. Uh, it takes six double A's, which I don't have right now. And there's actually a, a collapsible stock that goes in there. So you can actually do like one of these. 
and then you can be like, you can be like, uh, this one's a funny one, because this is, this is my rubber band gun, so this doesn't hurt that much at all, because I've been shot with this many times, so like, boom, uh, this one is also my favorite, but something happened to it, and as you can see, the whole back part broke, and I don't know if that's because of the spring, but it's funny, it still, it still will cock, like, look at, I don't know why it'll do that, and then the clip drops out, like, this, and then you can just see, like, this one's really heavy. It's mainly the weight is in the clip and the gun because this is all uh, the whole front part's metal. If you see inside of there. All right, this is my other uh, fun one. But what happened was that what happened to this one is that all the foam BBs fell, a, foam shots fell apart. So I just have the shells left. Like doing like one of these. And then be like, let's try to do a, a barrel, ow. So this baby, this baby right here, as you can see, this one is a pretty, it's a pretty long of a beast. As you can see, it's hurting my half finger trying to hold it out. And it does fire. I think there's 12 rounds in this baby. So you can just be like this. This is my scorpion that I got. I love it because you can reload it and then you'd be like, and then you go like this, you go. That one hurts. Here's the actual stock. And then when you see me, when you see me reloading it, let's see if I can speed up my reloading. Or sleight of hand, you'll be like. Actual metal BB gun that shoots, as you can see. It's a pretty, uh, pretty big one. That's what she said. I beat you to it. You got has small BBs there. Not much else to say. It's got a good weight to it. I'd say it's about three or four pound. All metal. My pride. This is my pride and joy. This is my favorite one. When there's actually BBs in it. This is my fastest shooting gun that I have. About four, 500 feet per second. This uses the gas in the handle, so there's no CO2 cartridges. It just gets fueled by like cool propane and stuff. Yeah, it's 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 this thing right here, that thing right there. That's your safety. This is no joke, you guys. When I got shot with it, well, in fact, you can still see the two marks. Those two blood marks are the marks, and then here, the one in the, my palm is still there, and the one right, well, that one you can't really see. One in my palm did, like, nerve damage, because when I poke it, it hurts, and it's been at least three weeks since I did that video. So that is all my Nerf guns and or BB guns. You feeling lucky, huh? Punk will do ya, and then I'll be like... My hand's too small to do this. Look at that was a fail. If I hold it like this, my, my fingers aren't big enough. Well, because I'm not that tall, really. And I'll discuss my height and other personal questions when I hit 50,000 subscribers. So I'd need to be like this. That's a fail. Look, I'll be a feeling lucky punk. Well, do you? How many shots did I take? Five or six? I think in the movie it actually he he shot he didn't he shot all of them or am I wrong? Please tell me else in the description. But that's a cool angle. I swear I have freaking Parkinson's because the watch closely. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna move my hand. Damn! Wow! I swear I'm starting to get Parkinson because when I hold things and I hold the camera, my hand shakes. That ain't that ain't a joke. That ain't no yoke. So yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Peace. Are we ready? Go. For 1,000... Closing your weapon. Give them to me now. That was weird. All seven perks. You'd be like... You'd be like this in the game. Sometimes it doesn't want to reload it that nicely.